Hello everybody, my name is Fizzle Me Dizzle and welcome back to another video. Today we're playing a game pretty much about anxiety and well it is about anxiety and to be honest I have really bad anxiety myself like heck I barely go out of the house half the time it's just it's just a hassle to do anything and let's just let's just see what okay uh, hassle to do anything really just put that back Ooh, I bounced it that's pretty cool read diary 6th of June I think I will not be leaving this I will not leave this room anymore Yesterday I had wonderful a wonderful night with with that guy but after all I bored I bored bored him with all my fears and insecurities sounds kind of like me sadly he left and will not come back I'm hurt and scared he he does not need me like this doesn't need me like this <laughs> I'm sorry I suck at reading no one needs no one needs I cannot change I, I will spend some more decades and after all that's left after me is just a fetid black dot I don't know what that means fetid <laughs> I want to see him again. Yeah, I want to see him again too. I'm sorry. Draw curtains. Hey! Oof. Scary. Put the curtains back. Oh, put the curtains back. Honestly, these type of games are kind of scary, to be honest. Because, like, dude. What if people see you? You know what's even scarier? Multiplayer games. What if people hear your mic going? That's what I'm anxious about. Multiplayer games. Knock that over. Put that there. Okay, let's read our emails. I'm sorry that I suck at reading, by the way. Hi. Yesterday it was a real was real cool, but you not accept anything out. But do not expect anything else. You scare me. You're a freak that cannot be changed. I'm not ready to live my life with such a her hermit. Your problems are disgusting and pointless. They are only yours, not mine. Best of wishes. That's really sad. Like, dude, why? Oh. Yeah, I'm gonna hide in here now. That was really mean of him or her. I don't know who it was. Well, I guess we gotta open this door. Jeez. We can always just play around with my clock, put it on the thing, play around with this thing. Yeah. I don't want to. I don't want it. <laughs> Jeez, this game is so sad. Well, let's try to go out the door and read this. Before leaving, consider this. Food can be bought online. Toilet and bathroom are overestimated by our society. Bathroom is down the corridor to the left. You don't need work. You have parents and welfare. Real people are irrelevant. Go surf some go surf some social networks now I don't think I don't think we're like that that bad unless you're like like <laughs> it's really hard to explain I mean it seems like it seems like you could just stay home like that is very true and you can also just like buy your food online and you can also like um 
yeah, y you don't need, you don't really need work if you have welfare, and you don't, you have parents, so, what happens when your parents die, though? That's like the most excruciating pain of them all that goes towards your heart, and it's sad. So, let's continue. I don't really want to go out the door. What's this? Another closet. Let's hide in it. Can't hide in it. <laughs> don't leave the room. I don't like it. I don't want to leave the room. Okay, but I guess we should, though. Uh, okay. So, they will judge me. Yeah, that's true. Just run back. I don't like it. Just reminds me of my real life sometimes. This game. Well, anyways, guys and gals. I hope you guys understand a little bit more. And if you do, I I just, just want to say. And if you are dealing with, like, anxiety a lot and stuff, then there's help out there for you and you can always go to somebody who's close to you and I, I found this out the hard way you can always go out to someone there's always somebody out there for you so well that's all I have time for today anyways guys and gals safe sailing and have a great day bye